Want your favorite song as your iPhone's ringtone? In this video, I'll show you how to set any song as your ringtone directly on your iPhone. No computer needed and it's completely free. So let's get started. First, you need the song you want as your ringtone. This can be any song you like, but it must be in compatible audio format such as MP3, M4A or AAC. If you don't have the song on your iPhone yet, you can download it directly using Safari or any music app. Once you have the song, make sure to save it in the Files app on your iPhone. Now that you have your song saved in the Files app, the next step is to install GarageBand. GarageBand is a free music editing app and we'll use it to turn your song into a ringtone. If you don't already have GarageBand installed, open the App Store on your iPhone. In the search bar, type GarageBand, tap the download icon next to the app. Once installed, open GarageBand. On the main screen, it shows a list of instruments. You need to choose Audio Recorder. This option allows you to work with audio tracks. Now, you'll notice a microphone interface. Ignore this for now. We don't need to record anything. Instead, tap the Tracks icon at the top left corner. This will switch GarageBand to a track view, which is where we'll be editing your song. By default, the track length is set to 8 seconds, which is too short for a ringtone. We need to make it 30 seconds long because iPhone ringtones can be up to 30 seconds. To do this, tap the plus icon on the right side of the track. This opens the section setting. Tap section A. Then, in the manual option, increase the value to 30. Tap done. Now, our blank project is ready with a 30 second timeline. Now it's time to add your song. To do this, tap the loop icon in the top right. Go to the Files tab. Then tap Browse Items from the Files app. Select your saved song from the Files app. Once the song appears in GarageBand, just tap and hold it. Then drag it to the left to add it to your timeline. If you want a specific part of the song as your ringtone, you can simply drag the left or right edges of the audio track to select the 30 second portion you want. You can also tap the play button to preview your ringtone and ensure it sounds the way you want. Yeah, I'm about to fade away cuz every time I wake up I feel like it's Monday, something's going wrong with that. Adjust the start and end points until you are happy with the clip. Once you are satisfied with your ringtone, we are ready to export it. Tap the downward arrow in the top left and choose My Songs. Long press your saved project, then tap Share. Choose Ringtone. Name your ringtone and then tap Export. After exporting, GarageBand will give you the option to set the ringtone immediately. Tap Use Sound As and choose whether you want it as a standard ringtone, text tone or assign it to a specific contact. Alternatively, you can also set it later from iPhone settings. Simply open the Settings app, tap Sounds and Haptics, select Ringtone. Here, you will see a list of all the available ringtones on your device. Look for the ringtone you just exported from GarageBand. Tap on it to set it as your ringtone. Now, let's quickly test it to make sure everything is working perfectly. Ask someone nearby to call your iPhone. As your phone rings, you should hear your favorite song playing instead of your default iPhone ringtone. If you ever decide you no longer want a custom ringtone you created, Removing it is just as easy. Just swipe left on the custom ringtone you want to remove and then tap delete. This immediately removes it from your ringtone list.